Okay, so now we're ready for our subject and you need to make sure that your subject has the hat on, no jewelry, no piercings, no socks. They should be in spandex shorts. His running shorts have the sliders built in. Then based on what the screen tells you, it's gonna walk you through the steps. So it's asking me to clear the scale. It's clear. Now we're gonna ask the subject to step up on the scale, face the wall, and do not wiggle. Be as still as possible. So once the scale has recognized his weight, the blue will come up saying next. You just click next. And again, it's really important that your subject stands still as possible. Okay, can you step off? And then once they're off, you wait for the next to show up. And it's clearing out the scale one more time. Now it's gonna tell me to open up the bod pod door, take out the cylinder, click next. It's gonna make sure one more time your subject is wearing the appropriate head cap as well as having the appropriate clothing on. So come over. I need you to go ahead and have a seat in the bod pod. The bod pod doesn't lock. Those are only magnets around the edge, so you need to make sure that you reinforce with your patient or your client, um, ask about whether or not they're claustrophobic, reassure them that this will not lock on them. At any point you wanna kill this study, you just push that little blue button that's down there below your knees, okay? You just sit still and breathe normally. Any questions? Okay. And then they just sit in there and breathe normally while the bod pod system will move, move air in and out for air displacement. Again, this is based on air displacement, whereas earlier um, over here to my right is the hydrostatic wang, and that system is based on water displacement. So now it's going to do a series of measurements. And it'll ask me to open the door and close the door a couple times, but you'll get to see the full test here. So that volume pass was completed. Now it's gonna ask me to open the door. And now we're gonna close it again. And you don't wanna be touching any of the outside of the bod pod and you hit next. And again, it's gonna make another pass on his volume to make sure that it's anywhere from two to three passes to make sure that the system is measuring accurately. So to open the bot pod, review the thoracic gas volume selection. So I'm gonna click next. Okay, and you can go ahead and exit. And you can take off the cap. And then we basically click next. It's gonna ask me to modify. So we come down here to his daily activity and he's uh, active. And we can see here that he's 3.2% body fat. He's 96.8% fat free mass. Total fat mass that he has is 4.8 pounds. Fat free mass is 144 pounds. His body mass is 149. So in order to maintain his resting metabolic rate is 1,697 kcals per day. And with activity level, his total energy needs he needs to consume about 2953 kcals is what this is estimating so we click next and then you would actually be able to print your results